this one, uh, this little minute, four minute or so, is for presiders, um, priests especially, and also those who prepare worship whenever we're together as the dissensions. One of the things Vincent was concerned about was that the liturgy would be celebrated faithfully um, the way it was designed. Uh, we've gone through a period of time where uh, there's been a lot of movement back and forth. The church would put out instructions and they'd be more or less interpreted uh, uh, faithfully, sometimes not so well. Um, and that causes a lot of people angst. So what does a Vincentian do? A Vincentian thinks like St. Vincent and says, let's do this faithfully. So that means knowing um, what you have to work with. And so everybody needs to study really well what's going on. And when you plan, plan together. Uh, priests with the people who are gonna conduct the liturgy, liturgy planners with all sorts of people to make sure it's a career and whole. And know that the liturgy gets presented in the sacramentary uh, with instructions on how it works. So it's incumbent upon all of us to know, for instance, what parts are fixed, what parts can be modified, um, and to stay with that. Um, there's a, a, a tendency to try to over-engage, to not trust the liturgy. And the humility of an ascension character says that we need to lean back into what the church has given us and do it just the way the church has designed it with very, very little uh, uh, movement. In fact, in the liturgy, there are only a few times where um, the priests are, are encouraged uh, to do stuff in, uh, it says, in these or similar words. Um, and and they used to be more of them. There are less of them now. And we need to, to know where that happens. I'll just give one example. Uh, so important is the metaphor of the Lamb of God. Um, is that something that should never be changed into something else? So you've probably heard someone just before communion hold up the host and say, this is Jesus who takes away the, the sins of the world. Happy are those who are called to this Eucharist. Well, that's nice, it's theologically correct. Um, but right there, the metaphor is the Lamb of God. So we're not given permission to change that. We say, behold the Lamb of God. Behold him who takes away the sins of the world. Happy are those who are called to the Supper of the Lamb. The Supper of the Lamb is the Eucharist that's being celebrated there. It's got its uh, kind of echo in eternity. Eastern Catholics know that better than Western Catholics sometimes. But that's just a good example that that's what we're trying to do. Not to be rigid, but to be faithful. Not to be uh, unwilling to acknowledge that there are people uh, in the room with us, but to acknowledge that we have received the liturgy uh, from a bigger group of people than those who are assembled. We've received it from the whole church now and in the past. And so a Vincentian is faithful to that. Let's work on that together. See you next week.